Welcome to welcome to Call of Duty Zombies on the PS1. It's not actually PlayStation 1, but this is a cool, cool little game that you can make it download or play in your browser. It is I mean it's Call of Duty Zombies. I'm playing Noct from World of War. Uh, not in my browser. I, you can download this, like I said, and that's what I did because it gives better, better frame rate for me. So, yeah, I should have collateral. Ooh, check this out. It seems only two. I see. But yeah, you can't infect, dude. They're kind of loud. You like shut up. Oh my God, dude, I know, I know exactly why they nuked. I didn't think it looked like that. All right. Maybe I got a better weapon than this. But basically, I did, like I said, say, yes, you can play this in your browser. I'll show that, uh, I'll show that when I die. Because, uh, I'm kind of middle of something. But, yeah, you can play this in your browser. And it's really cool. So, yeah, and the reason why some things kind of look, uh, like that is because I have a graphic preset. So, so yeah, um, it's really cool. I really like this. It's really cool. <laughs> but yeah, so, uh, I'll show you can play this in your browser. I die here because I know that'll be pretty soon. I think he's stuck. I'm out there. There we go. So, yeah. I like this though. Uh, for a game you can play in your browser, this is really well made. Yeah, hey, look at this. And it looks like it looks, it resembles something from like the PS1. I don't know about PS1. I didn't have the PS1 growing up. But the PS2 growing up though. And it looks something kind of reminiscent, reminiscent from that. At least in my opinion. Ah oh, shit. Now well, I died, so this is what the screen menu screen looks like. And um it's just that and dev things are bound to change with this. Uh here's the team. NZP team on Twitter and then YouTube at NZP team. So Yeah, and then they have a Patreon as well. Uh I you know, I'd buy that. But I'm poor. So uh anyway, you know, let me just go my Netflix. I was just gonna watch it. So I do do NZP.gay. Because for that C world they chose. Don't don't come at me for my bookmark edge. Shut up. Don't don't show. Hey, edge feather. This is why I don't use edge. I don't normally use edge. I decided to open for Netflix because uh this little browser down here doesn't support it. I don't know what's Hello? Does it not work in Edge? Oh, there we go. Look at that. You can play the game in the browser. It's loud though. So yeah, can't play this on web. If I just go to solo here, here are two of the themes because I have a freaking running in my PC down here, as you see. Anyway, look at that, you got knock, and there's other maps as you see too. Yeah, warehouse, warehouse classic, old rose with nuts. I mean, this is from the four nameless marines find themselves at the force. I can some of the text on this is kind of like first thing warehouse, or is it something more? Flight, but flight. Oh my god. Fight your way to uncovering its secrets, though you may not like what you find. Indeed, you may not like what you find. Indeed, so they got they warehouse Christmas. They got a Christmas special, and then click custom maps. There is two pages of of uh, custom maps. So we got two pages of custom maps to go through. But yeah, eventually you'll go through them all, and you'll be like, I want more content, which is fair. But you got all this. Can you really complain? This is the for our browser game. This is this is cool. Very cool. So like blood version three. Can I I guess we're playing house. I'm about to click blood version three. But I clicked house, so we're doing house. And this is I'm playing on FTE. How how sick. I don't know what that means. But it says that at the bottom, so should I close I probably should close out of this. I'm just I'm sure I want to quit. Yeah, just close out of that. I don't know why it did that with OBS, but it did that. It but yeah. Is this taking did it like break? Hello? Cause it's not loading. And I don't like it. Do I have to refresh the page? Come on, man. I swear it works on browser. I have videos where I was playing as my browser. The one time I used Microsoft Edge because I had it open. Shit, this really wants to do something. I'm trying to trying to get a video out, you know. I may not upload this, honestly. I don't know, because I Okay, let's try that again. Solo. Um, I should not for now, you know, I shall do the warehouse. Does this load? It'll like not work with Edge for some reason. I don't know why it wouldn't work with Microsoft Edge. Let's, let's see if it does not, I guess. I don't know. Do I really, really have to switch browsers for this to, I'm not playing this type browser. Fuck that. If this don't load, I'm going to cut it. But if this doesn't load in the next like five minutes. So a timer too. Just download the next five minutes. I'm not playing in my browser. You guys can go to the URL. It's up there. NZP.gay. 
or I'll also link it too in case you want to click that. I don't. I mean, I would rather you type it in than click a link because you shouldn't click links from strangers. And I am a stranger to you. Some dude on the internet trying to pull his videos. So yeah, uh, this doesn't load in the next five minutes. I'm just I'm gonna go back to the. Yeah. Uh oh, it did something. As soon as I started my timer. As soon as I. Oh god, the sensitivity. It's low. All right, that's better. But um, yes. Uh, this is very laggy. <laughs> I don't know why. This is why I meant I get better performance when now. But anyway, um, if you do place on the browser, you have to click because your mouser, mouser, <laughs> your cursor is gonna be unlocked. So just make sure you click into it, and then you can you can it'll lock the mouse to it. So yeah, but this works. I'm playing it on me. I'm playing this in my browser. I'm playing this on Microsoft Edge. A web browser. It works. You can do. You press V for knife. It won't. There you go. Press V for knife. It's Call of Duty Zombies. Oh God. I don't know why it's so laggy though, dude. The performance is way better on um. Should I lower this down? <laughs> Should I lower this down? Is this how I get YouTube videos out now? Yeah, dude. Look. Or not? I think I broke it. I think I broke it. Um. Uh. Yeah, we're just gonna. I'm just gonna stick to the uh, the, the mobile one because it's a lot. It's just a lot better. I just I recommend this. Uh, recommend downloading it. It's I've had it on my PC for a few days and actually a week now. So there's it's it's safe. You can use virus total scan if you want. If you're that paranoid and if it does come up with something and you're that paranoid, you don't want to download. That's honestly fair. But that is probably the play in your browser at that point. So this is very cool. I, I'm a fan. Can I turn my browser up? I cannot. I cannot turn my brand stuff. Okay, back to not. Back to not, because this is the best map. In my opinion. I should add that. I should, I should add a warning. I have an opinion. Oh, yeah, dude, this is so much better. If you want to know how to get your FOV up, um, I don't know if you can do this in the browser, but you press the, the key above escape, um, the tilde key, and it should bring this up, and you type help into it, and then you get, you get this type of, it's type of thing. It's a console type thing. If you ever play it, <clears throat> like Valve games, uh, like Left 4 Dead and Gears Mod and Half Life and. Half Life is console, right? I forget. Half Life was, I think, it's a console. I don't know. Anyway, yeah, it's it's like console. You type hop into it, and you get this menu, and then I think you turn it up here. I don't remember how I did it. Video options. I don't remember how I got my FOV up on that new model. How did I do that? Was it this? I don't know. Does it tell me? Because if you have ever most stuff, it'll like give you a description of what it does. I don't remember whatever FOV is in here. I don't remember. That's how I got it to effective. I don't remember honestly. I changed it a few days ago. So anyway, yeah, you can do that, and you can. Access some handy stuff. Like um, I should mention actually, go to options and I go to graphics presets. I didn't I thought it said options because I'm dumb. Anyway, yeah, you can select presets here, so they kind of make the game. They can make the game look um like like this. And make they can make the lights look all fancy. As you see, this looks really weird in the game with like the the like style. It is like the art style. This is style like a PS1 game. Uh, at least what looks like a ps1 game to me but like the lighting is like real time if that makes sense yeah oh my god look at that i can see my myself yeah look <laughs> so you can make the game look like this or you can make it look freaking poopy like how, like how i i can probably just yeah if you haven't noticed the frame rate when i had it on real time it was uh it was bad so you can make it you can make it look a variety of ways if you want that is it's all up to you by the way Depending on your your system, so if you want it the real time, you can add that. But there's um, it may may, may make some maps uh, you know, really dark like how knocked here was. So just a fair warning. But um, yeah, I mean, this doesn't look that terrible. At least in the preset I selected, which it said fast. I don't remember. It said fast something. I don't remember. Um, and it does that to lights. So yeah, nice. The nice preset performed pretty well. So. If you want to just, I don't know what it defaults to. If, um, you want a close, I think it uses nice. Shit, I didn't think that through. <clears throat> let's, uh, let's, let's try that again. <laughs> I didn't think that through, but anyway, why do I have no grenades? Never mind. It gives two? Unless that gives you on start, that might be it. So yeah, the nice graphic preset in that, uh, in that console settings menu may be the default, because that's why I think the default does, but I don't know for sure. I didn't look, I didn't read. Anyway, yeah, um, this is what this does, the, the lights, it, it looks kind of funky, but... Oh snap, I can go prone, I didn't know that. You can dolphin dive! You can do- oh my, I had- I'm trying to- hold on. You can dolphin dive, oh my god, I 
no pet. Dude, I've had this. I've been playing this for like a few days. Um, I've had it for like a few days, and just, I didn't know you could do that. The default spine for changing your stance is left alt, which I think is a horrible keybind in my opinion. So it's just a left control or C if you want. I think left control or C are good uh, binds for changing your stance. That's just me. I played my fair share of FPS games, and they've all. Oh, most of the most of the ones I played have had a similar bind for changing your stance. It's either C or Control or both. Kind of like Phantom Forces on Roblox. For that, you can do both. Uh, so you know, I didn't mean to. I'm gonna do that. I need money. You do that for money, like that. Yeah. So yeah, this is cool and completely free. This is a cool thing, and it's com a completely free cool thing. If you wanna, if you're looking for something to play, this is something to do. Although it is Call of Duty Zombies, so it may get boring after a while. But I mean, it kind of depends on like type of person you are. Also, I forgot to change. I recommend if you use one of the graphic presets, go back, go into the graphic settings, which is different to the presets. You, um, go into settings and graphics. I recommend turning retro on the retro effect because it uh, it just makes the textures look a lot sharper, and they just it. It looks better. Maybe not so much on the model hands. They look kind of crunchy. But it looks better. Because everything without that retro setting. Disabled when that retro setting is set to disabled. It just makes everything look blurry. And uh, yeah, I don't recommend it. And it, I think most people agree. So, I mean, if you want to have it off, you can. But I just recommend having it on. Because it looks better. And fits, in my opinion, fits the style of the game. Like I said, looks like a... Resembles a PS1 game to me. Despite I never had, but despite me saying I grew up with a PS2, because I did. But just when I look at this, it just looks like PS. I don't know. PS1's first thing. I, I don't know. I don't know if. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, let me stop rambling. Just, yeah. But then, okay, I had a headshot. That's what I didn't do. I did not headshot. Bop, I missed. That's how you do it. And now I have seven bullets. I think I have 2k points. What? You can knife, cuz. Ow. I did not need that. Of course, it was when this. It was, of course, it was for the zombie I meleeed. And it mainly caused me to move forward into the zombie directly. I kind of hate that. And then the devs, like, fix that, make it so the game doesn't. Why not give me this? Why this? I don't like this gun. This gun sucks. Stupid gun. Whatever. Give me my money. Zambi. Ah. Yeah. One. Or that was... Forget it. Alrighty. Do do memory. Alright, there we go. And fix this. That's not a headshot. Hello? That is. That is what? Bam! I get that one. I get you. Two shot headshot. Not bad. Maybe this doesn't suck. I just suck. Eh. Shot shot. Kind of. It can kind of be up. It's not. It's not be hopping like Counter Strike or anything like that. But I mean. It's fun to do, so you know. Oh, Where's the... Yeah, it's kinda... It's fun to do, that's really it. <laughs> okay. And I'm 3 done. So, I mean... It's pretty much just like... Call of Duty Zombies, you know. How it plays out. If you know Call of Duty Zombies, then you'll know this this play is just like it, except it looks like a PS1 game. So you know, and I think I think that's a cool thing about it. That's what I like about it. And there's also you know, and there's also the custom maps I pointed out. Two pages of those, so you see amount of content. I love the Thompson in this. I'm keeping this Thompson. Can I buy this off the wall in this? Yeah, you can buy this on the wall this map. Oh. 
If you're gonna play on this preset, the same one I'm using, things are gonna look a bit interesting, to say the least. Now give me my money. That's how you get money. You get an axe ammo and you still have the pistol for the Colt here, Colt M M19, 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 not M19, M1911. This is how you get your money up in this game. You spam the, maybe not the head, if you want, you know, if you want money, maybe not the head, because that kills them. I don't know where Quick Arrive is. It's not in the usual spot it is. Uh, an actual... Or no, there's no perks on World of War. That's old. But, um... What get, yeah, it's, um... What game am I thinking of? I'm thinking of... I think the Black Ops 3 Con uh, Chronicles DLC. Quick Arrive right there. And some other Rolex games. When they, um... That have knocked in it. The Rolex, like, zombie, caught zombie games. They have Quick Revive right there. But not, not this. The devs said, let's be different. And not do that. I mean, all power to you for being different, I guess. But like, think about the convenience of the player. Uh, there's no quick revive. There's no quick revive there, so I just can't. Hey, Magnum. I just have to. See. I like the sounds of this. I right, dive to this. No, it didn't. Alright, there we go. Alright, now we buy up- we buy up stairs. I'm pretty much just playing Call of Duty Zombies at this point, except the graphics are not, you know, nothing fancy, but I don't care about that. Some people might, and yeah, it's cool when games actually look good. I mean, this game, I don't know if it can look good. It just depends on your preferences, to be honest, so. It's just what I think. Hey, where are you? Bop. I missed. And I had a clat. That's wonderful. Okay, the sounds for these zombies may get annoying. Just a warning. May have already annoyed you throughout this video. Why can I not hatch on anything with this? Oh, I know where they are. Yeah. That. What? Hey, this game, man. This game. Ah, oh. Alright, see ya. So yeah, that's pretty much the game. It's Call of Duty Zombies. But you can, you can play in your browser or you can download it. It's uh, not hard to do. You just go to their Twitter. And then they have it right in there. In the, their bio for the Twitter account. You go to the Twitter and then it's right here. And then you click this. And then you just click this. You click the downloading thing. And then click here. Which takes you to the latest release on the GitHub. And you just download it here. Shit is on Linux. Dot 3D. 3ds dot, 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 I don't know what the 3ds mean. I'm actually gonna take a gander. What does that mean? What does the 3ds mean? I don't know what that means Can I put this in a fucking emulator is that what I don't know anyway, yeah, that's the video uh, Like if you enjoyed comment down below what you thought and subscribe if you're new and yeah, I'll yeah catch you guys in the next video. Peace